Hey guys, uh, just finished cleaning up the frame. Uh, bar brushed it with the angle grinder <clears throat> air tool with a wire brush on it too, and some sandpaper, some scotch brite, and all the uh, hard to reach areas. And uh, I used wax and grease remover on it a couple times, and then I used acetone on it just to make sure it's gonna be clean enough that everything will stick to it uh, I'm gonna use this it's called rust fixed uh, spray it on all the uh, rusted areas and it says it goes on clear and turns into like a black primer it has to sit for 24 hours though but uh, last night I wanted to do it but I couldn't get it warm enough in here. It was like 58 degrees and it has to be at least 60. So I wasn't going to take the chance. So I went out today, bought some kerosene, and fired my torpedo heater up here. And I think it's like a 70,000 BTU heater with no thermostat or anything. So it's miserable hot in here right now. I think it's close to 100. Yeah, <laughs> uh, 100 Fahrenheit, and uh, so everything's warmed up in here now. I'll probably shut it off after I get the wheels and tires back off of it up on jack stands and start shooting this and uh, let it cure for a day and then hit it with uh, some undercoating. The undercoating has to it says only like 30 to 60 minutes that it has to set up but I'll probably leave it in the garage for a couple hours and then uh, <clears throat> I'll go ahead and uh, pull the truck out cover it up with a tarp bring the bed in sit it up on the front side of it uh, knock all the loose undercoating off of it and uh, if there's any bad rusted areas I'll hit it with that rust treatment and I'll get it bolted down as soon as I can and take it out for inspection and get this thing on the road. Uh, I will need to get some winter tires for it. I know these tires that are on the S10 Extreme wheels won't pass inspection. So I'm going to go ahead and get some like studded winter treads for the back and put a little bit of weight in the bed. and. Then Probably just regular radials in the front. I don't know, I might just do learn treads all around. Whatever's probably the cheapest is the best way I'm gonna go with it. But, <clears throat> anyways, uh, I'll have it on the road then after I get the bumpers on it after the bed's been bolted down. The front bumper I ain't gonna mess with. I'll wait until spring. But the rear bumper I'll have to treat it for rust and, and paint it. But, it shouldn't take too much longer. Uh, I gotta get this done, get it on the road, get the other projects done, and, and then come back to this later. And then I'll tear it down partially and go ahead and sand it down real good, get it a nice uh, coat of primer on it, and then probably like a red with pearl on it. Uh, this is what I'm probably gonna go for. Uh, I might just leave that up to VW Darren. Uh, tell him to match me up a collar with the current red that's on it and uh, just put a little bit of pearl in it. I don't know. I've never painted, so he would probably know better than I do for sure. Uh, but just wanted to show the progress. Uh, tell us about this The top of it, it's pitted kind of bad in some spots but the sides of it looks great uh, since it had undercoating on the sides of course because the top of it was covered with the bed they didn't get undercoating on it so it's rusty but uh, anyways I'm miserable right now it's just way too hot in here I gotta get these wheels off and get this sprayed and turn the heater off so I don't blow myself up and 
get the show on the road. Plus it's like 10 o'clock and I gotta go to work in the morning, so I need to shoot this and get it done with. And uh, I thank you guys for watching my channel. Uh, uh, especially you guys have been with me every step of the way. And I enjoy watching all your guys' videos too whenever I get the chance. I don't comment too much and I I probably don't get back to you guys after you got comment on my videos too, but uh, I definitely love watching you guys' videos. Uh, I'm just an ordinary guy, likes to work on trucks and cars and, and it's just my uh, way of relaxing in the garage, uh, get away from other things in life and <laughs> just have fun here. Uh, love my family and everything, but this is just pure zen to me. But uh, anyways, I think I'm melting now, so I need to go. <laughs> so you guys have a good rest of the week and weekend, and I will talk to you guys later when I have the next update. Thanks. Bye.